Hey guys, what is going on? It is Fatal Shotty here. I'm back today with another video. Today I'm actually going to be doing a Let's Play through Red Dead Redemption 2. I will be chopping through most of the game. Like, I'm going to be skipping a couple parts, but I will be showing the highlights. Do not forget about that. Um, I'm re-recording my intro because the other one sounded like crap. So, I'm starting it off again. So, here we go guys. I waited so long for Red Dead to come out. And I want to let you guys know something. Uh, the video audio from my voice is kind of low in the first two episodes. But after that, it should be alright. So, we're just going to have to deal with that for the first two episodes. But other than that, it should be alright. Um, but yeah, I've waited a long time for Red Dead. They've had multiple pushbacks. And it's just crazy to see the games actually here. I'm so happy that it's here. And so, yeah, hopefully you guys do enjoy these first two episodes. Again, like I said, the audio for my voice is low. But you can still hear the game. So, if you guys are here for the story, it's there too. Lots of commentary. I make some jokes here and there. So, And there's minor swearing. I'm going to try to cut back into swearing throughout the whole series. So, here we go, guys. Base is crazy. Red Dead Redemption 2. Let's see what the first cutscene's like. Here it goes. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! All right. This is actually pretty cool. Starting off with snow, kind of like GTA 5. Chapter 1, Colter. Oh boy, so this game goes in chapters. Bring him in here! Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit, quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this, just for a short bit, 
I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. Me. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. I... We Yo, need you strong. Snow is crazy and the okay. light is amazing. <sighs> All right. All Let's go. head out. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close and we'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather! Been two days or more like this now. It has to blow over soon. Haha, <laughs> this is crazy. Coming up. Take it easy. <laughs> Can't believe we lost Davy, too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got fire and shelter. That's a start. And what about the money? Please tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It's stashed with the rest of the money in town. So apparently it'll be safe for now. But well, we sure like, can't go I, back, I go there, back there, there to collect it anytime uh, soon. I think I see something up the path. Kill as many people as possible this time. And I might do a good series where I am like the best person. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. The place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. 
How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean. We don't know. So guys, if you guys are new to the Why channel, please make business. sure you guys subscribe. Ask him if he's Whole video cut out. Uh, so hey, guys. Have you uh, seen so you guys John do, Micah? Like and subscribe. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Coming through. Yeah, okay. Yeah. You run into anybody else? I, I reckon we're the only ones crazy enough to be out. This Morgan. Yeah, well, don't talk to me about crazy. Oh, so no, glad you're all right. I was worried, Micah. Look, it's all gonna work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. Ain't much, but shelter. So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders, you know me. Right. How much further? Not far. Not an option. What does that mean? Not far. <laughs> uh, thanks. Not far. Not far. Okay. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Oh, nice, nice. I wonder if we can rob this place. Okay. Let's head down there. Snow moves like this. It's so realistic. Dang. I live with a lot of snow, and I know. <laughs> Five, yeah, like, Imagine how mine was like this. That'd be crazy. Bro, I would hate to have my car like this. That just means the promise of the I saw that. Let's hitch up here. Hold. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So it looks like we're coming up to a little house. And we're going to have to hitch up to. Let me do the talking. We don't want to scare these folks. Oh, the snow is fucking beautiful. Oh my Sounds God. like quite the party. So nice. You too. Get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Micah, hide behind that wagon. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of them. I said, get out of sight. <laughs> Hello? Shut up, Billy. Shh. Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well. Hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some... Trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. <laughs> folks. There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur, need some. There's a body food in the wagon. I hear you. Just gentlemen. keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy. Now, friend. So I got a knife, I can use my fist, or I can use a revolver. 49 rounds. I ain't asking for much. So 
So L2 is obviously the AM. Please. Nice. I am kind of desperate. Hey. I don't believe it. Come here, partner. Come here. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that was No one gets away in my <laughs> That's my boy, Arthur. God, that was God awesome. Damn, Driscoll boys here. Why? Dude. I don't know. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Oh, I do need to lose. So we're gonna do a body what do you think? Move on. Am I kicking them? Okay. Nice. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. All right. We need so the we get to loot. food, medicine. All right, guys. So looks like something happened here. There's like a bar fight. Someone got punched. And then last. Oh, Driscolls! I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. What we got here? Oh. Take. Whatever's in there, we're gonna take. Nice. Medicine. Place right. is dry, warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Huh. Looks like the poor bastard was married, too. At some point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Sleep on it. This man takes the blanket. <laughs> oh. oh, I'm starving. Well, you should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. All right. Hold that. Open central. Oh, nice. We have our own thing, dude. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. here when you're done. All right, let's loot the hell out of this place like it is payday. I can only hold so much inside my satchel though, so that's a downfall. Let's search another cabinet. What are we gonna find? Ooh, more food, nice, nice. So I know that this is a lot like San Andreas where if you eat too much, you become fat, and if you eat too little, you become skinny, like extremely skinny. So we're gonna try to keep the character I, I don't know yet. I'll probably decide that later in some episodes. But right now, it's looking like we're going to have to keep ourselves skinny. Because if, if there's a lot of winners like this, and the game actually progresses in seasons, yeah, we definitely are not going to want to be a fat buddy there. We're going to want to run and stuff like that. But right now, we're finding the cigarettes. Nope. Oh, cakes. I think cigarettes. It looks like a cigarette carton. So, yeah, guys. This looks like a great place to end off episode one. So, if you guys can... Please hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe. I'll catch you guys again in episode two. Don't talk. Oh,